Hey, if we head to Todos Santos, I'm gonna stop and get some Nappy Morado. That purple corn drink thing? If it's anything like corn atole, it'll give me the squirts. Everything gives you the squirts. I'm down for happy. All right, but they only serve it in the morning. Then you all will have the squirts all day. I ain't going near that shit. Bowman, we're in Flor de Oro. The trees there may be pretty, but that province is the heart of Uni Dad corruption. We want to break up the love of them Uni Dad the cartel. That means taking down General Barro. Commander of Uni Dad. How hard is he to get to? We've got no leads on the general's location, but we've got word of a data center at Uni Dad's mob Jaguar. Our source tells us it's chock full of informed personnel. It may even tell tales about some of the Uni Dad's less than savory operations. Sounds like a good place to find leads on General Barrow. I'm sending you the location of Bob Check right now. We've probably got the data center underground. Cool. And our source couldn't get us any password access, so we'll have to hack in. Hold up, we got hostile activity. Major General Barro is a patriot. He runs UNIDAD, the Bolivian military police force from main operating base Jaguar in Flor de Oro. When Santa Blanca first arrived in Bolivia, they went to war with UNIDAD. Innocent civilians got caught in the crossfire. The death toll was tremendous. Barro had seen a lot of death in his life and was desperate to bring peace back to his country. So he brokered a backroom deal between El Sueño and the Bolivian government. Unidad agreed to look the other way and let Santa Blanca run their business. In exchange, the cartel promised to keep their killings to a minimum. Obviously, the results have been a mixed bag. The relationship between Santa Blanca and Unidad is tense. Now that Bolivia has become a full-fledged narco-state, I believe that he is starting to regret his decision. Major General Barro is either one of our most dangerous enemies or our greatest ally. There's only one way to find out which. We're good to go. Hola, get tal? You hear anything about the cartel of the Sicarios around here? Gracias.
It's Nomad again. Sorry about the interruption. No problem. Maybe Sueño already believes Nydia Flores has sticky fingers. To know for sure, we need to get hands on Popo. Our intel places his junior partner and right-hand man, a guy named Wagner, at a silver mine in Barbechos. Grab Wagner and make him cough up Popo's location. Our friendly neighborhood CIA officer just sent us a video. Who's got the popcorn? is airborne. I see a second target. Baby Mates done. 3. Move. Let me get into position. Moving to a good sight line. Roger that. Target marked. Got the target. Moving to a better position. Ready to fire. Engaging. They're on alert. The lieutenant's on the run. You smell that way? That makes a gun smoke shit and blood that's hanging in the air? That's Santa Muerte creeping up on you. Your cartel made a deal with her, but now she's come to collect. Tell your amigos, you fight for Santa Blanca, you end up food for crows. Giresi se calma, yo le juro. I will quit. I will leave Bolivia. Much as I like fucking with these assholes, part of me thinks we shouldn't have let him walk away. Come on, man. Humiliation's worse than a bullet to a macho dude like that. The rebels are gonna love this.
Unidad's darkest secrets are hidden on a server at Mob Jaguar. Infiltrate the base, hack the server, and get me those files. I'm gonna turn these assholes inside out. Amigos, because of you, we have acquired some resources that we desperately needed. Bolivia needs your forces to be strong, and frankly, Pac, so do we. Soon our guerrilla force will grow into a true standing army. The type of army that achieves total victory. Muchas gracias. I got it. I'll fly. 